whoever can spend the most to acquire a customer wins. So what it means? It means that if you want to compete and to win uh, with your competitors, you have to invest a lot on traffic. So traffic, what it means? JBR in the evening or uh, Milan at six o'clock, no. So traffic means people. These people uh, like you, like me, people that want to um, solve a problem, that have uh, desires. So you have to, um, as affiliate, to invest your money we will see together with Fabio how to do it uh, with the Facebook today. Um, you invested your money to send traffic to the product that we have uh, seen yesterday called uh, front-end product. Do you remember? Lead magnet, uh, trip wire. So low cost product, let's say like this. So when we talk about traffic, uh, we have to uh, divide traffic into different categories. The first category is uh, free traffic and the second one is uh, paid traffic. Free traffic is like uh, blogging. You have like a blog or not yet? Not yet, okay. Blog, uh, CEO, social media posting. So basically social media posting, blogging, you write your blog and your post, you post on your Facebook page, uh, business page and so on, or paid traffic. Paid traffic, uh, Facebook advertising, Instagram advertising, Google AdWords, uh, solo ads, banner ads and so on. Today, we have chosen to focus on Facebook advertising. My suggestion in my experience until now is this. You as an affiliate, you can choose different uh, source of traffic, uh, but if you want to, um, to have results in a fast way, you have to choose one type of traffic, uh, one type of source, uh, and focus on that uh, source. For example, you want to do Facebook advertising, uh, learn about Facebook, become an expert on Facebook, and then go ahead on the other one. Otherwise, if you want to do everything, uh, you won't do nothing at the end of the day. So today we will focus on Facebook advertising. Why as an affiliate you have to focus on paid traffic? Because at the beginning people think, okay, I don't have so much budget, so I'll start doing uh, uh, campaigns uh, with uh, free traffic. And then when I start to do some, commission, some commissions, uh, I will start investing money in uh, uh, paid um, traffic. This is wrong because it's like, uh, how can I say, consider that this is a business, uh, this is not a joke. You are you are investing money in training and also you are creating your business. So you have to invest money from the beginning. It's like you are creating, a, so if you want to have a faster result in your affiliate marketing business, you have to focus on paid traffic. It's clear for you this concept because at the beginning I did the same mistakes. I said, okay, I will start posting on Facebook. I create a blog, but you know how many blogs out there are speaking about affiliate marketing, a lot of them. And people won't see your, uh, your blog posts and so on. But with Facebook, Instagram advertising, Google AdWords and so on, that are paid traffic is better for these reasons. Paid traffic is measurable. So I invest one dollar, I bet I will um, have as a result two dollar. Okay, great. The one dollar more I'll invest and I can scale it. So you have immediate results. When you launch a Facebook campaign, for example, you know immediately the results because you know the market, how it respond to your advertising. Bad or good way, for example, if uh, it's a good campaign, you will get immediate results. Otherwise, if it's not a good campaign, maybe you did some mistakes and so on, you won't see results. So immediately you will see the results and so it's measurable. It's scalable. You put one dollar, you earn two dollars and so you invest the one dollar that you earn to scale your uh, campaigns. Then cost money, of course. This is the only thing of paid traffic, it costs money. It's automated. You don't have every day to um, write a blog post, to do a video and so on. You create a campaign on Facebook and then you implement, you tweak it and so on, but it's done. It will go ahead uh, with no um, action required from your side. On the other side, we have to say that there is also free traffic, but you, um, as you can see, it will be like a manual labor. It will cost time. 
you have to write the, the blog post, for example, you have to uh, check for the copywriting, for the uh, keywords, uh, uh, find uh, like uh, some other uh, content article from other people to give value and so on. I'm not saying that it's not good having a blog, it's good having a blog, but uh, it's like a support to uh, engage your audience, to educate your audience, but to attract your audience, you have to focus on paid traffic.